Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So I'm really excited for um, how I'm planning my YouTube channel this year. So every other weekend, I'm going to be doing like um, a video of recreating all my liked videos because this is a small channel so some videos don't even have likes so i'm gonna do because i know you guys if you guys liked my videos that means those are the types of videos you guys tend to like more so i'm gonna be recreating all of them from the start like i started my channel in 2020 when covid started because i just got it to my new hobby and i really like making videos so yeah i'm really excited to do this so i'm still gonna be uh making videos of how i'm recently making them like uh spanish culture and like stuff like that learning spanish learning english but i'm also gonna recreate my older videos so i'm really excited and i'm also gonna do something different for my intros so for my intros i'm going to be talking about my outfits so i'm gonna be talking about where I got everything from, you know, because I like making those. I've never made them, but I've been seeing them recently, and I just wanted to make it. So I think these all these are called uh, Converse shoes. These are the fake brands. All of my shoes are fake brands except my Fila's. I got these in H and M. Recently, I've been wanting mom jeans. I don't think these have a name, but when I checked the tag, it said buy rewash. These are a size three. Because usually I'm about a size 1, so I got a size 3 to make them, like, a little bit more mom jean-like. This shirt I really love. It's called Divided. I got it in... Oh, I also got it in H&M because I'm really obsessed with that store. They have such nice clothes. This necklace I got this year for Christmas, which I really love. I don't know... Um, I ordered it, I think, well, my mom ordered it. I can't remember where, but when I figure it out, I'll put it in the description below. But it's really nice. And I also dyed my hair. If you guys want to know the brand, I'll put it down in the description below because I can't remember. So yeah, let's start the video. So the first video of my recreation of my YouTube channel of all my likes, the first video that got a like was the very first video I made, what to do when you are bored. So one thing I definitely recommend for when you are bored is making a YouTube channel because making a YouTube channel requires so much and also depends a lot on what you're thinking on making your channel about. So, like, you can vary it. You can do many different videos. If you want to do cooking, you know, you can share stuff like items you got and, you know, find recipes for your YouTube channel. You can think about how you're going to make your thumbnails to get views. There's so many things, like, you can never get bored making a YouTube channel because there's many things you can make it about. And, yeah, it requires a lot of time, too, to edit your videos. And by the way, I use DaVinci Resolve to edit my videos. The second thing I love to do um, when I'm bored is play an instrument. Like, for Christmas, I got a ukulele. And it is so fun to play, and it is so much easier than guitar. The guitar is also a good instrument. Probably guitar and ukulele are like my two favorite instruments, because they're the ones I usually play. So yeah, that is really good, because you can learn many different techniques in playing them. You can learn a lot of music. You can learn a lot of simplified versions, because like a lot of the music is only four notes. So all you have to get used to is learning all the different notes. So yeah, I would definitely recommend doing an instrument because it has been helping me so much with my spare time. Like that's almost what I do but pretty much the whole afternoon. It's pretty nice because you can do a lot of things with instruments, like learning many techniques. Next thing, you can bake something because baking of course, also requires making a lot of things. You can bake, you can cook, you can make recipes you've never made before, you can make different breakfasts, you can you can cook for your family, maybe make things for your friends, you can do many things. You can play around and buy different like cooking stuff. It's really fun actually. When when you when you get yourself to like to cook, you can get so many cool stuff. Like I've got this ice cream roll maker, which is so cool. All you have to do is put 
um, heavy cream and any ingredient you want to put and you can make many things you can make rolled ice cream or you can make regular ice cream and I also got a s'more maker which is really cool because you can make you can make s'mores or you can make I made a grilled cheese and it turned out so good so yeah I would definitely recommend cooking as well because it takes a lot of time next thing I recommend is um doing hairstyles like learning different hairstyles like recently I've learned French French braids, or you can um, you can learn how to do different styles of buns, like tight buns, messy buns. It's so fun to do. Like you, you it, it requires a lot of time, so you have to be really patient to do this type of stuff. But honestly, when you get used to it, like pretty much anything, it it is so fun. So yeah, I definitely recommend that as one hobby. Next thing, if you like taking pictures, you can uh, learn, um, what's the program called? Photoshop. Yeah, Photoshop. Pho Photoshop is great. Photoshop, you can do so many cool things. In fact, if you guys comment down below, I can make a YouTube channel on teaching you guys some things about um, Photoshop. I know how to make glitch effects. I know how to duplicate. I don't know too much because I'm a beginner and it's my first year taking photography. But honestly, it is, it's so fun. Like, I know how to change colors, how to, yeah, I know, I know a few things. I know the basics. So, yeah, if you guys want me to make a video about it, that would be great because it would be something new and different. And I like doing different things because I get tired of doing the same thing. So, yeah, just comment down below.